Emra, a family, a family from Wallingford, on vacation in Florida when their fishing trip turned into a rescue. They had to pull six people off a smoking boat right before it burst into flames. Reporter Vanessa Medina talked with the family about what happened. It was a great morning for the Barringer family. Visiting South Florida from Connecticut, they were out charter fishing on Lady Pamela 2. We were just out fishing for a charter and um, we heard fire. About a mile offshore, another charter boat, New Latitude, from fishing headquarters caught fire. And I seen smoke coming out of the vents and I seen the guys scurrying around. I looked down at my mate and I said, I think the boat's on fire. By the time I picked up the outriggers to go get them, the boat was completely engulfed in fire, all the way up to the fly bridge. And all the people were out on the bow. So I just went around and came up alongside the boat. It went from smoke to fire within three to four minutes. I'm telling you, it was ridiculous. Rushing to get everyone off as soon as possible, one man almost went overboard. Well, the way that everything with the wakes and, and the rocking of the boats, it just, they hit each other and he slipped. But he caught himself, thank God. Come on, boys. Let's go. She's going. We were yelling, did anybody call the Coast Guard? And, you know, the Coast Guard was coming on its way and it just went and engulfed in flames. Down the rail right here. Can I get everybody off? Rail right here. Yes, everybody's off. Rescuing all six people on board. Oh my God, they wanted to kiss me, but I wouldn't let them. <laughs> they were happy, um, grateful, lots of thank yous from them, including the captain and the crew of the New Latitude. So it was, you know, Lady Pamela, we just had to help out and do our job. It's not a bad day. And we also caught fish. And they caught fish. How about that?